I'm talking to you without any script today. I guess that's fitting because there's no script for any of us in the changed environment that Purdue and this nation, the whole world, finds itself in. So the last week, just a whirlwind of the coronavirus and all these universities canceling, including Purdue. So we're moving from classes in person into online classes. I'm going home tonight and I'm not sure when I'm gonna be back. I've started a task force this week to look at everything we do. We'll look at how we teach, how we learn, how we house people, how we feed people. I am glad that Purdue made a decision and made one early so we had time to prepare for that. We've asked each student and community member to embrace the Protect Purdue pledge. It is essential that we all adopt this strategy. I am behind the Protect Purdue pledge. I'm behind the Protect Purdue pledge. I've chosen to stand behind the Protect Purdue I am behind the Protect Purdue Pledge. I want to do my part. I pledge to help protect Purdue. I have faith that Purdue is going to do everything they can to keep us safe. I want to provide everyone with tools and knowledge to keep themselves safe and have the best learning experience possible. I have a lot of Boilermaker pride and I care so much about the Purdue community. It's been really encouraging to be on campus and see how many people are wearing their masks and social distancing and it's so nice to be able to go to class and feel safe doing so. We're here and I think that just makes the whole college and school experience so much better. As much as you're there for the education, it's also important to me that you meet people, make connections. You know, life throws at you all kinds of things and you just gotta roll with the punches. And this is just a really good example of how Purdue students are able to do that and they're able to adapt and they're able to learn no matter the circumstance. When Boilermakers see a problem, they go to work solving it. When they encounter adversity, they try to face it maybe a little better than most people. I just wanna say thank you and congratulations. Here's to you.